Hello everyone, I'm Alex Dumo and welcome to a new game of Amnesia. This is the second game which is called A Machine for Pigs. So yeah, first of all, like the first game, I need to create my own profile. I guess I can put whatever I want in here, but obviously I'm going to put my username. Create and select. Alright, now we're inside the game. So, start new game. And let's see what this is all about. Obviously I'm going to shut up once the cutscenes start going on. Here we go, alright. Uh, music is kicking in, but nothing's happening. What's going on? Oh, there it goes. He who makes a beast of himself removes himself from the pain of being human. Dr. Samuel Johnson. Daddy, please don't kill me. Alright. Is that from the machine for pigs? What is that? Okay, there's some kind of father in this game. Heavy breathing, obviously. Oh. I guess this is me. And how did that... Alright, thanks for that. Can I, can I see who it was? I guess not. I can't move my cursor. Alright, just a random person just opened up the gates for me. I went back to sleep. What happened? Right, there's some wine on the floor. Right. I'm a little bit dizzy at the moment. No idea what's going on. I just woke up in this bed prison, whatever this is. Hold down left mouse button and move the mouse in order to move the door. Alright, so it's the same controls as the first game. Do I have a lamp or anything? H how do you access your inventory? God, it's really dark in this room. Need some lighting. Well, there's my answer. There's a letter. What's this? June 24th, 1899. In my dreams, I see a man, dressed in a jaguar skins and feathered like a blood and stain. What came from the heart lubricated us. It crushed evil under its threat and liberated us all. The thwarted heat of the jungle mirrored somewhere behind my forehead. My temple pounds, the blood boils in my skull. It feels as if there was something alive in there. A rat, a damn rat gnawing through my brains, eating its way out into the world. Even the Lord and the one quell its endless hunger. I hear my children playing in the attic, but it fills me with terror, not love. What desperate thoughts are these? Let's open up the drawers and there's a Bible. Nothing in that one, and in this one... Near some kind of pig vase? No idea what's going on. I mean, I just started the game, obviously I don't know what's going on. All I know is this father thing is here. Or maybe not here now, but maybe in the future. Alright, let's go out of this room and see what's on the other side. Ooh, that's nice. Daddy, Daddy, find us! Am I the dad? A note has been added to your journal. For quick access to your notes, press M. Make sure to check these whenever you get stuck. So here it is, a fever dream. I wake alone to a house in silence. That missing sound of children playing is like a dark beckoning sepulture, beaconing me to begin a descent to the loam where surely only bodies may be found, no matter. My children call and I shall answer. I will find them. Something tells me these children aren't actually real and it's just in his head. But if they are real, well, <laughs> Let's try and find them. So we got different ways we can go and then downstairs there's a green lamp. So we got I think a bathroom down there and mm, there's some stairs there. I can barely see that. And then here I'm gonna check. Okay this is another bedroom jail cell. I don't know why they have the jail. And watch the blood pool between your legs. You lived long enough to see Edwin but not Enoch. I will take care of them, my love. I promise you this. What? But it doesn't have a lock on it, so it's not used as a jail cell. 
Anyway, let's just search a room and try and find something in here. There's some more wine bottles. Is this an alcoholic? Maybe that's why his memory is all gone. Okay, there's another one of those bays. It must mean something in the future. There's that green lamp again I saw downstairs. And it's just a regular green light. Alright. Over the left side of the bed. There's some kind of note, but I can't access it. So I can't do anything about it. In the end, there was nothing inside here. So let's just head out. Uh, maybe cl even close the door. I, I don't know why I do that, but just to be sure. Now let's go to the bathroom because that's just the stairs and that brings me to a different level. So let's check this out. Uh, and there's a toilet. Well, obviously it's a bathroom. Let's see if there's something I can get inside here. Oh, I got a memory. And there's nothing inside here. So, yeah, pretty much just a memory. Alright, we explored only the two places, I mean three places, because there's obviously the part where I came from. And now let's go upstairs. Don't know why not downstairs. Oh, alright. Getting dizzy again. And this light keeps on flickering, now it's turned off. What's on top of here? I heard a door. And yeah, it's that door there. So, on the left here... There's some more wine bottles, so yeah, it's definitely an alcoholic. It's, it, there's bottles everywhere. Should I go in there? Alright, I can hear some, some footsteps, but... Okay, that door doesn't open. Let's go through here, I guess. Close the door in case something happens, <laughs> which it did. But still, there's nothing in here. There's nothing inside these rooms, and I can't get out. All right, now I can. Nothing outside. Great. Always a good sign that if you can't see anything. Definitely have to hear some noises. Uh, shall we go in the attic? I guess this is the attic. I've got another journal now, so I'm gonna read that first. Let's see. This one is called Attics and Nurseries, but they slept in the attic when they were babies in arms, and perhaps they have hidden there now. I remember I insisted upon it, midway between my bedroom and my office. So the children might be in the attic. So I'm gonna check that after. Probably this door is not gonna budge. Exactly, so I need to go in the attic. Let's go up there, I guess. I mean, it's the only way I can progress the story. There's a bad man coming. Well, that's always great if you call the bad man. And it's really dark. I almost can't see anything. Who put that on? I always, I always hated them all things. Oh, it's on the other side of here. Yeah, I know that. I can use a controller? No, I don't need it. There's another Bible and another note. Let's see it. Edwin and Enoch's diary, October 11th, 1899, so the same year. Daddy says there won't be a Christmas this year, he is much too busy. Nanny says we must not disturb him, he is ever so busy. He has gone for work before she wakes us and often we are asleep before he returns. We found a bird in the garden with a broken wing. We gave it to Nanny, who said it was a filthy thing and hit it with a rolling pin. That's awful. Later we crept downstairs to bury the body when everyone was asleep. There was a pig in the garden. We heard it sniffling about. Then daddy came and said we had to come inside straight away. He was furious, but we think he'd been crying again. Where- uh, can I turn off this music? Where is the music box? I can't see anything. Ah, uh, just forget it. Never mind. Um, what's through here? Oh, that's probably where it is. So there's a children's bedroom there, with the door open, and, oh, a flashlight. It, more than a flashlight, it's a lantern, but what was that? So the two children are up here, or oh, it's all in my imagination, probably. Let's continue, and no jump scare, please. No jump scare, good. Let's check the right hole. I don't think there should be anything down here, apart from my window. Nothing down here. So let's go through the hidden pathway here. It's a pretty small pathway. Let's move the box and go through the... There's that pig head again. 
but I can't do anything about it now. We're hiding, Daddy. So we're playing hide and seek? You should have told me before, before you start hiding. Oh well, I really don't want to go in there because it doesn't look like to be anything in there. Maybe a memory? Who knows? Well, obviously, who played the game knows. Let's make it through here, and here we are. So, I think I'm gonna end the episode there, and next episode, I will check out the bedroom and check out what is going on with his children, if their memories, if they're real, and yeah. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, why not leave a like rating, and if you're new around here, why not subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Goodbye, everyone.